I don't know why my people have been banished from their homeland, but they have. They've been sent to this place, an island perhaps, and they've just made themselves a little house. So well done them, I say. Uh, this is Isabel Wright. She's my advisor, and she's going to teach me how to survive and prosper in an untamed world. To gather food, so we'll take this person here, and we'll make them pick some blackberries because that's why they fled their previous home. More sources of food and assign workers to them. Okay, there's one. I'm going to guess the big red wavy flag is a clue. So grab you, plonk you there, and we'll go over here. And you can pick whatever they are: apricots, cherries, plums. I don't know. Well, they're not cherries because they they don't look anything like cherries. So these people are thinking about. Um, how there should be a, a global ban on hammers. And while this lass over here struggles back, don't help her, mate. That's fine. That's fine. Don't give her a hand. That's okay. You just stand there and play with your moustache. Lovely. This is, oh, there we go. Stockpile food. Gather wild fruit. That's what I was doing. Gather five units of food. Is there a fast forward button? Because that's going to take a while. Try the menu. No. Nope. Okay, so is there any other food that we can maybe speed this up with? Can they pick a mushroom? I'm going to take someone over to the mushrooms. I'll grab you by the feet. No, I'll grab you by the arm. There we go. Come over here to the mushrooms. Mushrooms are delicious and they're so good for you. No, you can't pick mushrooms. Can you pick the big red toadstooly thing? No, that'd probably end the game prematurely. So we'll just uh, have everybody wander around. So I'm not playing an MMO this week because I um, didn't fancy it, to be honest. I'm uh, I'm more of a uh, simulation buildy type game person, so I thought I'd try a simulation buildy type game. Is that the name for them? Simulation buildy type games. I've got three units of food. Well done, me. He looks really angry. He looks angry. I think he's bored. But that's kind of not my fault. There's only so much wild food to collect, and you just you're not getting a go at the moment. But unless I can do two people on the one, you come over here, mate. Have that. There you go. See that sped everything up, and it stopped him from looking quite so cranky. Which I think is a bonus. I've got three. I've got four. I don't know where the pots are coming from, unless they're sort of naturally occurring pots that happen under wild food. There we go. I completed my, my task. I'm amazing. Okay. This colonist is hungry. You haven't even done anything. You've only been there for two seconds. Oh, slack. Eat food. His name is Paul. He's an apprentice. Hmm. Wood is the primary building resource. Animal tracks into the forest. Okay, to chop wood, assign a colonist to the forest. Where's that girl that didn't have anything to do? There she is. Oh, right next to the forest. Well done. Come over here, chop some wood. There you go. Five units of wood. Yeah, I'm going to put someone else on that because it's slow. I've only got one. Oh, where's this guy over here? He's full of food, so we'll put him over here. See how happy he is? Why is he so happy? Who have I got? Susan, Sharon, Mark. Ah, Mark. Has Mark got a beard? Yes, it's Mark. He's taken a break from running his website, and he's now a colonist on a far-off land. Clearly all of these people were expelled from their original homes for blogging. There's a novel idea for you. Don't forget, National Novel Writing Month is coming up. I don't know whether I'm going to compete this year. I'm just filling in time. I'm actually just going to put everybody over here because um, life is short. You know, I don't mind a slow-paced game. But when you're recording it, you know, I feel like there's pressure to be more interesting. I should probably stop scrolling around, but I'm not gonna. Go over here. Here's Mark.
It's not even anywhere near the fruit. And there's one of those pots again. I don't understand. Can I pick them up while they're carrying stuff? Does that work? No. Okay. Lesson learned. I just lost some peaches or whatever they are. The music's very soothing. I may fall asleep. Come on, guys. Is there a fast forward button? Did I ask that before? There is no fast forward button. Let's go and have a look over here while we're waiting. Oh, look, there's things. There's some um, alpacas, llamas. Our llamas? I cannot go there, so I'll go down here. Not much of a bridge. I can't go there yet either, so that's moot. Oh, big relicky head in the jungle. I don't know where this island is. I mean, it's in the ocean, obviously. Quite a nice waterfall. If you're into that sort of thing. Everybody's taking their time. That's fine. You know, I suppose, you know, the place they were banished from, it was kind of a hurly-burly, so they just, they just kind of chillaxed now. They're kicking back. They're taking their own time. They're doing their own thing. Good for them, I say. Okay, that's five units of wood. Our workers found a marooned sailor. We must. We have nowhere for him to live. We must solve this problem immediately. Okay, fair enough. Where is he? I don't see anybody. Oh, there he is. Maybe? There he is. Oh, look how sad he is. He's got nowhere to live. Oh, he's devastated. So, we will build him a house, maybe? Yeah? Okay. He's so sad. Okay. Nowhere to live. If we build a house for him, he'll we really need him. Okay. Click here to enter the building screen. And there's a house. And we'll build a house. Okay, yeah? Is that all I do? You have laid the foundation. Okay. Read the little poppy up screens. That's always helpful, I'll find. So let's um well let's make Mike do some manual labour. There we go. He's pleased about that. We'll drop her on too, because she looks like she'd be quite handy with a hammer. I don't know how they're keeping their hair so nice in the wilderness, but, you know, it's not for me to question. So here we go. How long is this taking? Oh, not so long. Oh, look, he's so sad. I can't zoom in on him, but he's so sad. He's, oh, pat him on the head. Poor guy. There. Oh, no, I didn't mean to pick him up. I'll just put him there. He's alright. He's okay. There we go. Look. Build a house. Where did the paint come from? Oh, it's probably mushed up berries. That'd be it. Seeds and berries. And flowers and stuff. That's, that's it. It's quite a nice house, considering it's made out of... Where did the bricks come from? Paul is still not looking cheerful. He's still a grumpy looking dude. There he is, stomping off back to the forest. Maybe he never wanted to be a lumberjack. This is a lot of work just for one guy. Couldn't he live on the boat? See, you could put a cloth over that and sleep below decks. Be lovely. Be cosy. Be nautical. Okay, so there's a little house that I built. Our new colonist now has a house in which to live. He's given us a pickaxe. Thanks. Where were you keeping it? In your pocket. So I've got no tasks now. I am taskless. Everybody's standing around looking at me expectantly. There we go. Town hall is in terrible shape and is too small. We must upgrade it. Make the first upgrade to the town hall. I'm going to assume that this is the town hall. Welcome to your warehouse. Thanks. There's all the stuff I don't have. And what does that button do? Um, town hall? Accommodations? There's five. I don't know how to upgrade it. Buildings? No? Yes? Ah, upgrade button. I will upgrade it. And that's the last of my gold. Never mind. Oh, I got a, I got a uh, medal. My town hall is far from finished. That was quick. That was quick. 
Everybody's bored. Look at them, so bored. We came to the new world in search of the spring of eternal happiness. Oh, so they weren't exiled, they're on a mission. To find it, we need to, ooh, we need to explore the surrounding region. Let's start by moving the stone obstruction to the north. Oh, we have a time limit on this one. You come over here, Mark. Come on. Come on. And you also... Oh, stop walking around. I'm trying to boss you around. I'm giving you orders. Come over here, Susan. She's really unhappy about that, but she's just going to have to deal. Come over here, Grumpy. Come over here, Stephen. So that's basically everyone. Although I've still got people gathering food because I don't want people to starve. You know, I'm not a monster. Nobody looks really happy to be working. I don't know what they expected. Come on, guys. Hustle. Uh, before we clear a field for planting crops, we must build a well. Salt water from the river. Hmm, must be close to the ocean. Oh, would that be buildings? Buildings. Well. Done. I just need someone to build the well. You're clearing, you're gathering food, you're clearing, you're chopping wood. Well, you can stop chopping wood for a minute, Sharon. Do that. Thank you. Very kind. I'm going back to these guys. That's quite quick, considering they only had one pickaxe. It is quite a soothing game. That's why I'm not saying much. It's not because I've run out of stuff to say. That's not a thing that's ever happened to me. But now I've got two simultaneous tasks, you know? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a multitasker. I know you guys are tired and everything, but if you could hustle up. Come on, everybody. Quick sticks. I don't know why I said that. I say that to my dogs to make them cross the road quickly. Sometimes it works. You don't care. I'm going to tell you anyway. Come on, Susan. Put you back into it. So we'll go back up here. That's basically cleared. I mean, they could step over that one, surely. Going through the gap. What's up here, anyway? Ooh, look at all the stuff. There's stuff everywhere. There's a, there's a thing there. Okay, all right. We are now free to expand our colony northward, and we found a hermit. She's an experienced farmer. Well, of course she is. What hermit wouldn't be? Has she got anywhere to live, or is she going to be sad sack? She's all right. Okay. Expert farmer works gathering crops. Lovely. How's the well situation? What is the well situation? I hope it's going well. Ah! ah sorry about that. Let's find a, an unworking person them to work. No, you're a farmer. You keep your hands nice. Oh, well, they're all still doing um, stone gathering. Come here. I don't need any stones at the minute. We've got 16 of them. We're absolutely overflowing with stones. Colin, colony needs a lot of iron. Okay. Oh, okay. That's another timed quest. Rush up here. Rush up here. You, come here, grumpy. Is that the iron mine? Yeah, I thought it might be because it looks like a mine. Small platform up there, presumably for my for my throne and my coronation ceremony when they all start worshipping me as their god. Should be quite soon. We found a treasure. Go us. So now we... So that's the field, I'm guessing, because I saw the well thing pop up before. Yes? Oh, okay, it needs clearing. So we will put people on it. Oh, actually, you need something to eat first because you've gone all sulky face. So we will go down here. Are you hungry? Yes, all right. Never let it be said that I'm not kind to my tiny minions. Only because I'm recording. After this, I shall remove the food table. So is there anybody not doing anything? You're eating. 
Mark's not doing anything, so Mark can do that. Mining stones, doing nothing. Well, that's because you're a farmer. I'm saving you. Gathering food, mining stones. Sharon's not doing anything either. Oh, okay. This colonist is mentally and physically exhausted. Oh. So now that she has to do chats. There we go. So that's, oh, I see. That's the little smiley face. And I'm guessing that's health. Everybody's quite healthy. I forgot to look after the mental health of my colonists. I feel quite bad about that. She's alright, but she's hungry. Come and have some food. Wow, that field cleared really quickly. How's the iron mine going? Clearing the upper field, clearing the upper field, talking, doing nothing, and we're saving you for farming purposes. There's Paul, he's quite hungry. Come on, have some food, this is ridiculous. You can't just work yourself into dust. You, come with me. Fix that, good girl. Now, I don't know that we need any more stone at the moment, but okay, no, look. You know, you, you just go ahead with what you're doing. That's good. I'm glad. Everyone's fairly occupied. Where did the rope come from? We found treasure. Perhaps pirates left behind. There could be more, so keep looking. Find five treasures. Oh, I already know where they are, because I saw them. Here, you. While we're waiting for the farm situation, dig that up. Thank you. Okay. Preparing to become a worker, preparing to become a farmer, preparing to become a worker, you need something to eat. Yeah, I know. Put that in your face. The field is ready for planting. That's amazing. I'm so excited. Are they planting stuff without my consent? Are they just going ahead and planting stuff without even asking me what I should plant? What they should plant? That's rude. Where's the farmer? There she is. I've changed my mind about that. Come and do farming. You come and find treasure. I'm harsh but fair. So, I don't know what I'm planting. What am I planting? Okay. We have restored the iron mine. Good o. You can be a miner. Oh no, you're, a f you're preparing to become a farm. What are you? What are you? What are you? Okay, you can do the mining. You can do the mining. Would you do the mining, please? Thank you. Very kind. You find a treasure while you're up there. You might as well. You know, this is not the fastest game in the world. But it's kind of nice. It's kind of zen. I feel zen. I feel calm. I feel like the lives of these tiny little minions are in my hands. I don't think I don't think I want you to be a farmer, Mark. I'm gonna make you be a uh we'll find a treasure. I'm just gonna find all the treasures and then we'll call it a day. I said very badly behaved. Okay. There we go. And there's the iron coming out. Everybody's Shuffling along, there's another treasure. I'm going to be rich beyond my wildest. I mean, there I'm going to split the earnings with my colonists. I'm certainly not going to run away to Spain with a big pile of treasure. That would be wrong morally and ethically. Hey, I grew things. They look delicious. What are you doing? Nothing. Okay. Find a treasure. Let's find a treasure. We'll zoom you around a bit. Oh, that looks like a treasure. It's a skull full of gold. Just what I wanted. It's time to build a forge. I'm kind of busy with the treasure situation. I only need two more and then I can um, retire. Ha! Huh. I don't fill in the hole. Somebody's going to fall in that in the night. You're a farmer, you're mining, you're not doing anything. Okay. You can 
dig up a treasure. For the good of your glorious leader, which is me. It's quite a lot of gaps. I'm guessing there's quite a lot of stuff to build. Oh, there's a treasure. That's alright. That's okay. I'll get that later. I won't tell them about it. I'll just keep that secret. Um, I don't really know where to put you. I might... Uh, you can chop some wood because nobody else is. Also a working compass. Now we can repair our ship. I don't think that's how ship repairs work, but okay. Now we can repair our ship and start trading with the capital. And that is me calling it a time of timefulness. Um, the end of the time that I am recording for. It's quite late at night. <laughs> so that was quite a little peaceful Zen game. I'm going to keep playing until I fall asleep. Um, so thank you very much for watching. I hope that you didn't hate it. And I will see you next week with something else to play that is also fun. Or possibly not fun. I never know till I start playing.